Hey guys, it's Mewtwo is Strong, and welcome to the next part of my Kirby's Return to Dreamland walkthrough. In this spot, we'll be finishing up Dangerous Dinner, so let's just head inside the third and final normal level of the game. And we start off by being shot through cannons, so let's get time this right and good. We don't want to die as soon as we start off. I already did that, as you can tell by my life counts. So let's just get the fire ability and. Oh! Excuse me. Oh, come on. There we go. So, ah. Slowly moving giant fireball, okay. Oh, wait, I want this. They aren't even aiming for it anyway, so, ah. Uh, didn't have to destroy all of them, oh crud! Ugh, I still want to break these even though I might die doing it. There. Oh crud. Wait, so no! Ow! Okay, let's try this again and not die there. Oh, I timed that wrong. Dang it, come on, we can do this! There. We can time simple attacks. Oh jeez, okay good, I still hit you. Hey, that's my food, don't guard it. Aw, <laughs> dang it. Let's just wait for you to pass. There we go. Oh. I didn't really want to do that, but okay, fine. And there's our first energy sphere. So, oh crud. I need an ability for this. I guess we'll have to go ahead a little further. By further, I mean like... Five feet. There we go. Let's try and come on. Let's fire a sphere. Oh, who cares? Ugh. Okay, good. There's blocks down here. I don't know if they're gonna be that nice in the last normal level or not. There's our first energy sphere. Oh, crud. Okay, now let's get the spear again. Eat some mint chip ice cream. Come on, get up, thank you. Oh snap, dang it. It was too big for me to avoid. Oh jeez, they're getting bigger. Oh, whatever. Hello, Chili. Ooh, time for a mini boss! Let's battle Dubior. Uh, oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, oh, come on. I mean, I like being able to hit the button, mash the button quite a bit, and then I won't have to keep attacking, but sometimes it doesn't really work out. I just regret my button mashing. Oh well, let's get a Maxim Tomato. I probably should have timed that a little better, because I wasn't even paying attention, but oh well, we still got it. Hmm. Oh jeez. That's a massive fireball. And ooh, there's a 1-up. I don't really want it, though. Okay, let's keep going. I know there's an energy sphere in this room somewhere. I think it's above this guy right here. Oh yes it is! Can we get to it? Yes, come on, haha. -ha. I was quick enough. Now let's get in our boot. Let's see if we can do this in one try. Oh, I guess not. Attempt number three, haha, -ha, we did it. Again, technically, I made it with my second try, but I fell down here because I did uh, some 
terrible things up here with this boot that caused me to fall. By terrible things, I mean forgetting that I can jump on this Gordo. Somehow. But it doesn't matter. Let's just get our second energy sphere. And head back. Oh, no you don't. Hot- Oh, I couldn't eat the hot dog, so well. We'll just get swallowed by the giant burning fireball. Now let's grab this! Haha. -ha. Oh, I probably should have gone the other way, oh well. We'll just walk into the... Lava, I guess. So it doesn't matter. Now let's grab this key, and we're gonna need to keep this key throughout this entire room. Yeah, don't drop it. I know it'll be a lot of fun, so... Can't let it touch lava or anything, because as we know, keys do not like lava, and they melt. Oh, crud, I probably shouldn't have... Oh, oh, oh my gosh! Out! Go away! Okay. Alright. Get out of there. Alright. Here I know we're gonna have to go really fast. Ugh. Okay, good. We still made it. Did I actually do that in one try? Yes! I'm so proud of myself. And there's another train outside when there was one like... I swear, 20 minutes ago. I specifically waited to record this episode so that wouldn't show up, but made its way in some way, somehow. Whatever, let's just get our Ultra Ability. Ah, out of our way. It's one of the last times we get to use this, so... Gotta use it for all it's worth. Oh, jeez. And ooh, three slices of pizza. That was definitely worth it. Wait, oh, wait, no! Oh, okay, we still got two tiny stars. We're killing harmless flowers, but... We still got stars! Hey, no! Don't come running over here, bonkers. Uh, can I still reach it? Please? Aww. Oh, there was another one over here anyway, so it doesn't matter. Oh my gosh! I could have gotten crushed to death, and I'm running out of time. No! Need to hurry and find that portal! Giant fish, okay. That's just too great. Alright, let's go to another dimension. Oh, come on, dude, go faster. One of the few times I actually want an extremely deadly object to go faster. Oh, 
Oh, jeez. I was not expecting those blocks. Okay, water, let's swim. You should be getting put out, but... Uh, you don't have to follow logic. Come on, dude. Out of my way. Come on. Thank you. This is already going slow as it is. Oh, it really wouldn't have mattered then. Dang it, I wasted time. Okay, we made it. Oh, jeez. Everything's disappearing. Of course, the water ability. Let's battle the sphere. Ooh, two sphere doomers. Haha. Our final battle with them is with two instead of just one. Oh, dang it. Stupid fireball. Oh well, at least they're already almost down. Alright, your friends out. Why did I jump like right into you? Why do I do a lot of things that seem obvious enough to avoid? <sighs> Whatever, we got our final energy spheres of the game, so let's head back. Rider or Warp Star? And now that we all, yeah, now that we have all the energy spheres, all that's left is to take on the boss. Alright, so let's battle the boss of Dangerous Dinner, Landia. Now, in general, Landia's attacks are- oh, dang it. Already got hit. That's definitely a great sign. But anyway, in general, Landia's attacks are that it, of course, shoot, shoots fireballs, as you saw. It flies low to the ground to smack us with its tail. It dives at us. It has two heads that breathe streams of fire across the stage. And it also flaps its wings to also... Ah, jeez, I'm not very good at explaining this right now. But as you can tell, it, it flaps its wings to cause wind and currents to hiss. Come on, up! But there may be a few minor variations depending on how they want to attack. So let's just start attacking. Haha! -ha. You didn't come close enough to the ground. Oh, come on. There. Oh no, you don't! You still can't reach me, yes! Oh crud. Okay, you were taking way too long. I don't know if you're gonna try and do something else, but okay. We're getting close, come on! No! No streams of fire! Now, when we 
cut Landia's health in half, it splits into four smaller dragons, and of course its attack right now is that each of them will fly around the stage and shoot a fireball from above. Ugh. Then four of, then all of them will fly randomly around the stage and connect to each other via electricity. That shocks you and is of course painful. Come on, then two at a time will dive at us, but of course, as you can tell, since they indicate which ones are going to move, it's pretty easy to tell. And then they just start passing around a giant fireball. But we should be able to take them out before they finish this, come on. You can do it. Well, I'm surprised you didn't fight that at me, man. It would have been a really easy time to do it. There we go! Landia's down, and we've won. Thank you. 